What's going on, YouTube? This is your DraftKings Attic, bringing my top picks for your Friday DraftKings main slate, guys. All right, guys, so if you watched the video yesterday, guys, I had some fire picks, man. You know, yesterday we were on um, quite a few players, man, but KCP went off, Lamb went off, Deadman did okay, and J.J. Barrera put up 40. He did great. And Diallo, yeah, he kind of disappointed me, man. So that was the one dud of the night, man, but... Four out of five ain't too bad, huh, guys? But um, some of the players that I said that I like for today's slate, you know, did pretty well. Uh, like Rubio, you know, so, um, you know, guys, hey, Blake Griffin as well. Spoke about him. He did. He went the fuck off, you know. I think he almost had a triple-double. But anyway, guys, so this late in the NBA season, guys, we got to play the late swap contest, guys, okay? Couple nights in a row, people have been burnt by late scratches and all kinds of craziness, all right? So you need to play in a platform that has lay swap or suffer the consequences if your player gets uh, gets ruled out. You know what I mean? So um, that's why they have lay swap, guys. So, you know, hey, DraftKings has lay swap contests. Uh, Yahoo has lay swap um, draft. Uh, it's an application that you can play that has late swap. If your players ruled out, it'll allow you to go in there and uh, draft somebody else. So you got options, guys. But, uh, you know, hey, this is NBA DFS, man. This is how it gets it this time of the year. You know, you got to play smart. So let's talk about the players on the screen, guys. All right, so this is the uh, Vegas scores that are out at the moment. If you look on the screen, all right, we got uh, a couple of good games on here, guys. We already got some Vegas totals out, guys. We got Brooklyn and Toronto right here. Expect to be a blowout at 12. So maybe we go there for some value maybe. Unless you think the game is going to stay close, you know. But, hey, somebody could be ruled out and, you know, that can change things. But uh, right now, guys, the games that I'm liking that I'm focusing on, guys, is going to be this L.A. Clippers and Indiana game because they both need to win. This Denver-Washington game, high score, close, total. You know, one team only winning by one or two points. All right. I like this Minnesota-New York game too as well, guys. All right, I'm just saying uh, New York plays well at home. But, you know, oh, this Milwaukee and Chicago game, too. It's a pretty nice game. All right. If Giannis is ruled out, I'm probably going to have a lot from that game, too. And it's Utah. The San Antonio game is going to be a close game, guys. But look at the damn over and under, bro. 195, man. Two snail-ass teams playing against each other, man. So, you know, if you can play anybody from that contest, just know you better play somebody with a real high usage because uh, they won't have too many attempts to uh, – to score DraftKings points on, on uh, with this game because uh, this, this, these are not fast-paced teams. All right. And the Atlanta and Golden State game is going to be a blowout, guys. You know, Golden State at home. Atlanta's trash. They pretty much, you know, they're over with. So, all right, guys. All right, so let's go ahead and get on into today's picks, guys. So, all right. The app that I use, guys, to select my picks is the Draft Dashboard. In the description of this video, you will see a link for a seven-day trial for $1. Check it out, guys. Give it a look. If you like it, subscribe. You know, sign up for the subscription. If you hate it, cancel it. You know, but it's a seven-day trial for one buck. Give it a shot. But what I do is, guys, I go in here and I go through the position optimizer by clicking on this. And as you see, it opens up with the point guard. And as you see, guys, LeBron James is uh, now eligible as a point guard slash small forward in DraftKings, guys. Whew. Yeah, that's what we've come to in the NBA, guys. All right. So as you go go through here, guys, you like your players by hitting, putting them on a the watch list right here. Or if you have players that you do not like, you exclude them. Maybe you want to fade them, you know. But you, you watch your players by clicking on the watch player list and you go through each position, guys. So as you can see, on for shooting guard, one of the plays that I'm going to be on is Josh Jackson. All right. Because I think that uh, Bledsoe or either Warren is going to sit today and this guy's going to get run or they'll get blew out the building and this guy's going to get run. So I like him, for, you know. All right. Small forward. Everybody's going to be on Middleton, you know. Everybody's going to be on Middleton because, again, you know, he's in a good spot. But for me, I'm going with Otto Porter, guys. If you look right here, you know, 6.6K, you know, 20% usage. They're at home versus Denver, a pace-up team. So I like Otto Porter, guys, today. But um, anyway, as you can see, this is how I go through and I find my players. And once I get done, I go over to my watch players. Actually, I'm sorry, I go to my uh, lineup optimizer. And when you click on that one, it'll build your optimized lineup based off the players that you like. And then you can go ahead and upgrade players if you if you feel the need to. So, 
All righty. <clears throat> like the lineup, save it. Bam. You're good to go. Another another option I like inside here, guys, is finding sleepers. You know, click on finding sleepers, and this this is all players, quote unquote, sleeper players, man. But again, another player I like today is Jabari Parker, man. You know, with ABC possibly out, this guy here is going to uh, get uptick in minute, minutes and usage. So, also Alex Lynn, that was a guy I played last week and he went off, and I like him versus uh, Cleveland, especially if he gets the start. All right, guys, he plays the stage close. He plays if he gets blown out. All right, cool, cool. All right, so that's draft dashboards, guys. All right, let's go on ahead and get into these picks, guys. It's late. All right, first player that I'm going to put on my board, we already talked about him. Let's go ahead and get it out the way. That would be Otto Porter, guys. I like him versus Denver. All righty. So if we go over here and look at our DVP, you know. All right, so if we go down to Washington, and you see small forward, power forward does pretty good versus this uh this team, guys. So, But I like Otto Porter. He's a high-usage guy. It's going to take a lot of shots. They're at home. They need to win this game. All righty. If you look at the last time they met, he played 32 minutes and put up 46 points. He put up a double-double. Hit a couple of threes. Had a couple of steals, guys. So, I like Otto Porter. Last few games, he's had a couple of steals as well. So, I like him in this matchup at his price point, too, guys. At 6.6K. I love it. I love it. All right. Otto Porter. All right. Another play for the night. We talked about it again already in the video. I like Josh Jackson, even at 6.9K. This kid right here, man, he's he just a ball hog, man. You know, he puts up shots. He got 20 and 19 shots in the last couple of games. He's getting rebounds, you know. He he plays hard. But if uh, Bledsoe and Warren sit this game out, I'm locking in Jackson, guys. All right. You, you see this. He played 34 minutes last time. These teams met, and he put up 33, 34 DraftKings points. But I like him as a safe four guy. I think he's good for at least 30 guys with a little bit of upside as well, as you know. He has upside. As you can see right here, he put up 54 points on Golden State. All right, so this kid can 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 flash flash greatness. All right, but as of right now, I like him. Another player I like today, guys, talked about him in the draft dashboard. All right, this is Jabari Parker, man. You know, last game, he played 30 minutes. All right, that's the most minutes he's played all season, I believe. <laughs> you know, but with Giannis possibly out, guys, I like this guy to come in and put in work. All right, if Giannis is out and this guy is announced as a starter, you know, I like him. Lock him in. All right, he should be good for at least 35 DraftKings points, guys. All right, I know everybody like Milton. Milton's a little bit more pricey. I hadn't decided if I like Milton or Bledsoe Bret- yet because their prices went up considerably. So, me, I'm going with the discount uh, at Parker and playing uh, Otto Porter, who has similar upside to uh, those players, in my opinion. All right. So, next up, another player I like, guys, due to injuries and my little late-night hammer, is going to be Andre Iguodala. Iguodala. All right. So, he's playing around 25 to 30 minutes, depending on the situations. But, again, if you look at the Golden State Warriors lineup, all right, look at all these players that are out in game-time decisions. All right, so I believe Curry plays personally, but you got Caspi, you got Green out, you got Clay out, you got Durant out. You got a lot of players out, and Iggy's getting the – well, he's projected to get the start. So I like him. He's an NBA player, veteran. You know, I, I like him to, uh, to uh, maintain this game and uh, handle things when Steph Curry sits on the behind. So I like Iguodala for the value, 4.7K, late night hammer. All right, another player I like, guys, this guy right here. Sadaransky. All right. So if you look at it, he's playing 30 plus minutes easily. Last game, he didn't do too well, but that's versus San Antonio, man. Nobody does well versus San Antonio, okay? Not in my opinion. You know, San Antonio has a nice, scrappy defense, but this is different. We're talking about guys. High paced games, they giving it up. And so if you look at Sadaransky, last two, last time his team met, he played for four minutes and put up 6.8 DK points, guys. This guy's playing over 30. I personally think he's going to get us about 35 DraftKings points. Easily, in my opinion, just with assists and peripherals, you know, assists, rebounds, you know, and maybe a couple of three-pointers here and there. But, hey, well, not three-pointers, but uh, steals, I mean, okay? So, I like Sadoransky, especially at 5.5K in a pace-up, close game where both teams need to win. All right, I like Sadoransky, guys. So, there you go. That's my top five plays, man. As you can see, both all my guys are under 7K. You know, it leaves you about 7K for each position. And, hey, guys, you know, if you – 
want to pay up for some of these studs on the on the block like Westbrook or James. I'm not paying 12k for James. I don't give a damn who he playing. That's just me. But uh, y'all have fun with that one. All right, but you got Jokic on the on on the late. You got Lillard, Lillard playing against Boston. You know, you know, damn can easily put up 50 points. You know, he can go off, hit 12 three pointers. I like DJ versus Indiana. He's been killing the rebounding game, guys. Look at 22, 12, 16, 21. All right. I like DJ as well, guys. So I like in DJ. That still gives me 6K. All right, per player. I like Aldridge. Again, that game is going to be slow pace, but it's going to be a competitive game, I believe. And Aldridge uses his through the roof with all the players out, okay? And San Antonio needs this win. So look at his last couple of games. He's averaging 50 DK points over the last three games. And he's only 8.6K. Yeah, he's playing Utah. All right. That's all gravity. But, hey, this guy's going to play big minutes, and he's going to put up big points because, again, he's their go-to guy. Look at he's He's averaging 25, 22, 25 um, shots per game, guys. All right. But anywho, I like him as well. So if I like him in as well, that leaves me 3,900. All right, guys. So can I find a value play for 3,900? Probably, you know, probably somebody from Chicago. You know, all their uh, point guards and stuff are injured. So, you know, maybe we throw in a point guard from there. All right, so who they have on on point guard? Grant. There you go. This guy here. Oh, not him. Wrong Grant. The other Grant. This one right here. All right, if you look at the last game, he played 25 minutes versus Denver. All right, they're slim at the point guard, and he could get some run. So I like this guy. If he gets some good minutes, he could put up the 25, 30 draft king points on his team, man. Just saying they don't have Giannis, all right? And bless those defense is no defense, guys. Come on. Let's keep it real. We used to attack him when he played in Phoenix, all right? You play point guards versus Bledsoe, literally. That was the, you know, hey, just look on the on, on the list and see who was playing against Bledsoe and lock him in, <laughs> you know? But uh, anyway, so if you do that, look at that. You got you got a pretty decent line, I think, you know, for cash games. You got Aldridge, you got DJ, you got Otto Porter, you got uh, Parker, and you got Jackson, all right? With with some nice nice little old value guys in there that should get minutes and should you know be able to produce at least twenty DraftKings points or more, so. But hey, again, just an idea, guys. But uh, all right. Good luck on tomorrow's slate, guys. Again, look for the late swap contest, guys. Don't get burned again, man. You know, again, it sucks when you know because I had tonight I had a lot of Dennis Schroeder. I liked him. Well, I only paid like four lineups, and three of them had him in it. So my night sucked. Okay, I bet twenty bucks, lost it all. Well, I won 50 cents, so I pretty much lost it all. But that's how it is, guys. It's DFS, man. Don't play more than you can afford to lose, you know. And, again, if you don't play the late swap contest, don't get mad because you can't late swap. I'm just saying. All right, so good luck tomorrow, guys. Hit the like button if you like the videos, guys. Please subscribe, share it, follow me on Twitter for any updates or any uh, any advice or questions or whatever. Hit me up. And let me know how, how y'all did in, the, in the, uh, the comments below, guys. Did you play the plays from yesterday? And did it help you cash, guys? Holler at me.